hello and welcome to little knit channel my name is maria and uh, today i will show you how i close the gaps on um jumpers underarm this is the method i use when working a jumper bottom up so i had 11 stitches on each side that i um, worked together and bind off i had 11 from my sleeve and 11 from the body and after binding off these stitches i have two gaps one here and one here that i just closed so i will show you how i am carrying my yarn in this side just wave the yarn through the stitches and now I go in around here but I will try to insert my needle through the yarn as you can see just a couple of stitches for for the moment I won't pull tight my yarn and I go around like this. So remember, don't pull tight, at least not yet. I go through the stitches, as you can see. now i will start to pull the yarn more gently so what i do i actually split the yarn of the stitch like this now i can pull more and again i've reached the the start so my gap it's already smaller now again So just follow the stitches on each side, go back. Now I will look on the front side of my work and see here I have to um, wave a little bit more. So I'm splitting the fiber like this. Right, I look on the front side, it's okay. Now 
I will wave the yarn again but this time I will try to go um, in zigzag not in the same place don't pull tight because we don't want to change the stitches or the tension of the stitches on the front side of our work so remember split the fiber and wave through And I think it's enough. I will cut the yarn and I will show you how the work, <clears throat> sorry, looks or look on the front side. So this is a sweater. Okay. So this is how the work Look, and I think it's a finished, a, a good finished look without gaps. I hope this will help you. Bye bye.